King Arthur, and there's Sir Lancelot, and the Lady Guinevere, and a whole lot of others. It's pretty when you take your time, ain't it? Those names. I kind of like them. You know what? Shut up! Ah! Ah! Is that voice ah! okay? Why, oh, John, it. stop driving crazy. Gotta enjoy life while you can. I bet that sign says strawberry, don't it? I got a good feeling about this place. Been a long time. Ah, shut up. I'm gonna go see what kind of good, honest work I can find. Grave digging or polishing some rich fella's boots or some such. Where the hell are you going? See if me and the boy can find some laundry work or something. On your way. Go. You! Hey! Help you, son? I'm hoping I can help you. I saw the help wanted sign outside. Sure, but uh, you're a bit old to be stacking groceries and running errands, ain't you, son? You need to take a look in the mirror. <laughs> Time's hard, Mr. Uh, uh, Daddy Dutch? Morgan. Yeah, my wife and I, and our boy. We was robbed mm. a few days ago. Lucky to get out with our lives, we was. Now, uh, you look real sad, you know? Well, we need money. Uh, there's bad folk out there. Yeah, <laughs> tell me about Not it. a wagon by any chance? Uh, sure. Well, then maybe you could run some goods up to Pronghorn Ranch for me. You know, uh, head west past Owen Gila, then follow the road north, lead you right there. Why not? So, is this happening or not? Where's the wagon? It's just outside. Um, you know, I should go tell my daddy, and then I can come back and get loaded. Oh, my boys can load you up while you go. Thanks! Come on then, big guy! <laughs> ah! Thank you, doctor. Hey, <laughs> how you getting on? I found some work. Me too. Delivering goods out to some moron. Cleaning a doctor's surgery. You should find a new line of work. Shame on you, John Marston. Don't be like this. Go to hell. You deliver them goods and then collect me. Don't bother me. And John, I love you. Don't you forget that. Not ever now. You ever shut up? Load her up pretty good, Milton. Good. Now you ride slow now. Yetis don't want his goods damaged. Shut up! I ain't that dumb! Mr. Geddes? No, sir. Thanks. Well, Mr. Dickens, his overseer. Dutch? Morgan. I'm delivering some supplies from the store in Strawberry. Okay. This is quite a place. Yes, it's beautiful. Oh. They send everything? Yeah, I think so. So, partner, your boss, he looking for hands? Why? You looking for work? Yeah. My wife. We was in business with her family and turned sour. It's a long story. Yeah, I don't know. Married hands. It's a lot of trouble. I'm a good worker. My wife, Agatha, even our boy, Lancelot. We'll all work. Big man around, boy? You! Hey! Get the hell out of here. <laughs> now, that ain't very neighborly. And threatening us is neighborly. <laughs> hey! Mind if I enjoy one of these apples? Why not? <laughs> Delicious. Thanks. Oh. 
When's uh, boss man gonna sell this place, boy? I don't think there's any plans for that. You boys want a drink? <laughs> it's some fine scotch whiskey. Put that down. Put that down. Oh, these supplies for the season. Get off the farm. Come on. <laughs> we know when we're not wanted. Get down from there. <laughs> Shit. Bye, bud. <laughs> Come back here. Take that horse if you need it. <laughs> hey! Hey! That's my damn wagon! <laughs> Shit! Hey! This is your last chance to come out of this breathing! No! Oh, whoa, whoa! You can't take a joke, mister! Now you're breathing! Soon you ain't! What's in this? I'm in a hurry! You're gonna die! Goodbye. Dutch? Morgan. Those boys are out of Laramie. Work for Mr. Abel. Thank you. Don't mention it. Listen, I ain't looking for no charity or nothing, but I was serious. You got work? We'll work. I can do anything. We got... We got robbed ourselves a few days back. We ain't got married hands here. You're married. Don't play games with me. I'm real honest. And my wife, even though she's got fancy thoughts, She'll work. Seem kind of desperate. What trouble you in? Getting fed up with you treating me like this. I wasn't gonna rob you, mister, but now I am. We'll give you a chance. I'll let Mr. Gettys know when him and his wife return tomorrow. Thank you, Mr. Moron. I'll go get my wife. Nah, no, you stay here. It's getting late. We'll go get her in Strawberry. We'll bring her here tomorrow. Thanks! Need you around in case any more of them Laramie boys turns up. There's a, a little cabin out yonder past the ranch house. Things work out, y'all can stay there. Thank you. You'll not regret this. Yep. Go get yourself settled. We'll have work for you tomorrow when Mr. Gettys returns.